Good morning, everybody. We are here at Ayala uh, Center. Where most of the call center companies are located. You can see the tall buildings around. It's a beautiful morning here. It's a very sunny morning in the month of April. What I would like to show you is basically this store selling everything where most of their customers are call center agents right after the office hours and you can see some of those who are taking the breakfast on these particular stores and uh, this two well couple couple whose name is Jackson Malasarti Jackson Malasarti and ikaw manang Gigi Malasarti they are the ones providing breakfast for all the call center agents after their office hours uh, sometimes they are off at 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock in the morning. So what we have here? Anything that any Filipino would like to eat, they have it here. From empanada, mango pie. Oh, and they have this mango pie. And then you have this uh, peanuts. You have this... Uh, uh, maize or corn. You have the small chicharron, and these are the typical Cebuano delicacies. We have the bocayo, the piñato, and then the sambag, or basically sweetened uh, sugar coated uh, sambag or uh, tamarind. You have all these small cookies, anything that they can sell, and anything that call center agents are able to buy and eat, especially after duty hours. What's the name of Farmer's Market. Ah, so they, they call this Farmer's Market, and the Malazartis uh, is one of those. There are three stalls in here. And I think the Malazartes have most uh, things or food displayed for everybody to eat. You have banana queue, the pinay pie, you have the toron, you have the hopia, you have the fruits like the avocado, you have this banana, apple, lemon, you have peanuts, and all of these vegetables that you can name of. Where you can buy the onions, garlic, ginger, the bell pepper, the uh, pepino, the tomato, and you have this calamansi, and then chakutingan any Indian mango? Dele. Oh, senorita mango. You have this orange. You have this uh, uh, watermelon, um, and then you have this banana, the sweet mango, the ripe ones, and uh, I forgot the name of this. Uh, I always buy from Carbon. We'll go back to that later. You have the papaya, you have the sweet potato, you have this ayoti. You have this cabbage and then the gabi. You have this guyabano. And they have every food that you can have for breakfast. And these are three of those call center agents who are eating breakfast after this their office hours. Uh, would you like to be included in the vlog? Shout out. <laughs> Censored. <laughs> <laughs> censored, censored. <laughs> so, come on, my call center agents, Miss. Yep. Yep. So, what's uh, company? 
ay kabalaka ako call center agent ko sa una what was way back what 2010 converges what naman aron but uh, I, I I stopped di kaya slawas uh, malanas mga bata nun so on sa company me if you don't mind anyway I mean you don't have to answer cash every day it's an online loan Task every day. Uh, unsa may kinsa may yung client sana. <laughs> ah, okay, okay. So I, I I presume it's an online loan, right? Or you just uh, out outbound calls, inbound, inbound. or oh, inbound calls. Okay. So uh, basically, the office hours probably ends like eight o'clock in the morning. So. After office hours or after their duty, there you have this breakfast, and it's not easy to be a call center agent. I can relate that because I was one, and it took me only four months, and then I stopped. Health is wealth, money is not wealth. All right, uh, but for those fresh graduates, uh, one of the most attractive jobs because. Who can earn 25,000 pesos or more a month after you graduate? Ilam da inyo ron? Ano ron? Tutobutan na nga range ko yun. Oh ba? Barat na day kayo ron mga call center companies? Ha? Oh, I see. Anyway. Yeah, because 25,000 is big enough for a fresh graduate. And then you have the quarterly, what? Incentives, group, and everything. So sometimes a call center agent earns before a minimum of probably 40,000 pesos. That's how converges earn before. Because a lot of uh, telcos, uh, client here in the Philippines, uh, most of them are American companies. And I believe uh, the client of this call center agents are abroad. It should be multinational. Like a bit even more. So basically, this these are the the hangout of this call center agents after duty hours. And thanks to these two or a couple, manang. What's the name? Name of the couple? Forgot. Gigi and then Gigi Hadid. Jackson, Malazarti couple. Without them, this call center agent probably will be eating somewhere in McDonald's or Jollibee which is very expensive and uh, according to one of them um, they cannot earn the 25,000 peso a month range so it would be more practical for them to eat uh, a, a more delicious more nutritious food during breakfast not the fast food type and Manang Gigi also is cooking the, the nutritious food, the vegetables, you have this meat, um, you have the adidas, you have the, uh, the chicken wings, bola bola, lumpia Shanghai, and the never uh, been forgotten adobong baboy here in Cebu, and then you have the famous shiomai, and then of course they are also selling lugao and then the shumai that they have and then they are selling lugao and then you have this uh, sampurado which is basically a oops a chocolate uh, sticky rice uh, porridge then you have their snacks the boiled egg the shakur the pancakes or the hot cakes where I remember when I was in elementary this is basically our snack foods during recess and all the drinks or the juices that they have the mixed fruits avocado and then you have the lemon or calamansi and all those snack foods like popcorn banana chips all those chicharron and everything so this is located at the back or at the middle of uh, Ayala Center where you have three stalls, 
two are open, one is closed. And I believe most of these call center agents are working on top of these tall buildings here in Ayala. So basically, a, it has given also jobs to this couple to sell. And they have been here since last year. And hopefully, they will be opening up their own store or karinderia probably outside of this place one of these days. Diba, Nong Jackson? Uh, any plans of putting up your own store other than this? Right? Because uh, you will be progressing with your business, especially with the help of these call center agents. And hopefully you are also giving nutritious food. And the call center agents also are making your business more progressive. So thank you very much, uh, Nung Jackson and then Manang Gigi, for your dedication to provide food for the call center agents. Thank you and good morning.